Hey, we have an integral on the board from MIT Integration B 2022. This is problem number 14. We have the integral of sine x plus sine x minus sine x minus sine x dx. Before I get started, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. Thanks for your support. Appreciate it. Now let's get started. So the first thing I notice is really whenever you have anything complicated inside of a sine or cosine function, the first thing you usually would like is if you could do a u substitution here, but there's nothing outside of these sine functions that's gonna help us. So what I wanna do is use a couple of trig identities. Okay, so we have these two formulas. We have the angle sum and angle difference for sine on the board. And then you'll notice this is gonna work out exactly what we want, but both of our pieces, this, this first piece we can use angle sum, and the second piece we can use angle difference to rewrite our integral, and hopefully that'll help. So let's do that. Okay, so rewriting our integral, you'll notice that what I did was I set, so we have our a value, which is just an x, the same thing here. So our a is x, and our b value is sine of x. So we use that and we wrote, rewrote this whole integral. And I wrote, the, I wrote it this way for two reasons. I was gonna run out of room, but also because it's gonna uh, line up nicely, was you'll see that this term is exactly the same as this term. We have this minus sign. So this one's gonna cancel. Then here with these, this is the same term, but we have minus minus, so this is gonna be a plus. And then we're gonna end up with two of these, two cosine, sine, sine x, dx. But now we've actually simplified this enough that we actually can use a u substitution. So again, this piece is still kind of complicated, but if I make this my u, this should work out nice. So we'll call u sine x, du is gonna be cos x dx. We have our cos here with our dx, so that's gonna be our du. So we can rewrite this whole thing, we'll bring our two outside. So we're gonna have two sine of u du. And now we got a very simple integral. So to finish this off, we'll just integrate and we'll have minus two cosine u plus c just need to back substitute. And so for our final solution, we're gonna have minus two cosine sine of x plus c, and we're done. So I like that problem a lot. So that's gonna be, that'd be MIT Integration B 2022. That's problem number 14. Thanks for watching.